Thrown from a horse and killed at the age of three, ATV's Aaron Cox shows, how, shows us how friends and family came together Thursday night to support each other during a neighborhood tragedy. Pink balloons. She loves pink. And a prayer service for Taisley Hills. How's today been? It's been tough. Taisley was life lighted from her home in Petersboro to Primary Children's Hospital after being thrown from a spooked horse last Tuesday. She sustained a serious brain injury and was pronounced dead Wednesday afternoon, something her cousin said he never thought would happen. This is nothing you could ever expect, nothing anyone wants to expect. Uh, it's a terrible tragedy and we'll do our best to get through it. But Taisley's family doesn't have to get through it alone. So grateful for the support from the community, and from all those who were able to come and those who weren't able to. We feel their love and are so grateful for them tonight. Here with messages in balloons for Taisley. I think it'll really help the kids, you know, knowing that they get to send her a balloon in heaven. And I think um, this is what we need, you know. We all just need to come together. Together, after a moment of silence. Taisley, we love you. Aaron Cox, ATV News. Taisley's parents donated her organs to Primary Children's Hospital. There's a GoFundMe link on our Facebook page for you to donate and help them cover medical costs.